Hello everybody on YouTube, how you doing? Uh, I want to wish you all a happy Thanksgiving. And uh, I am, look how long my hair is, this is crazy. But it's uh, gonna be Black Friday soon, the biggest sale day uh, on the planet. And I am doing a 30% off discount all day, starting at midnight. So, hello to everyone. Well, I'm filming this on my phone. But I just want to announce that, you know, at midnight, which is almost like an hour away, maybe an hour and 15 minutes, I'm doing a 30% discount on my website for my hair products. The salonguy.com slash shop. So, and I'm, I'm showcasing this live for the first time ever. Hello everyone, how you guys doing? I'm doing all right, I'm hanging in there. Hanging in there. Here it is, right here guys. Slick. This is my newest product, it literally just came in. Oh man, this is a very, very unique pomade. Very unique. Uh, and I tested this on a number of people and look at that, man. That is beautiful. It smells so fresh. Really, really clean fragrance. And uh, this is going live tonight, so it's part of my 30% discount. The unique thing about Slick is that it's, hello everyone, uh, is that it has a medium hold, it's got medium shine, but as you work it into your hair, it actually is great for someone who doesn't want like a whole lot of shine. It's like a natural kind of shine and you can work it in. So if you're not like a pomade person, but you want something that's gonna give like a little bit of a nice texture, then this is amazing. I'm telling you, slick. Just came in, man. So if you get this tonight, you'll be the first to have it. Um, yeah, I'm not doing anything in, in India right now. I can ship to India, but good luck <laughs> getting it. You know what I mean? Um, but yeah. Hello, El Salvador. Hola, como estas? <laughs> Mucho gracias. Uh, I really appreciate that. So, how's everybody doing? Anybody here celebrating Thanksgiving at all? So far, it seems like the only people I've been watching are people in India or like other countries. <laughs> Um, hello, how do you say hello in, uh, it's 30% off, code BLACK30, it goes live at midnight, which is like an hour and maybe 10 minutes away, 30% off, the salonguy.com slash shop. Um, this is $19.99 for this, so plus 30% off. Uh, I'm doing all right, Jose. You know, my back is really, oh man, I've been doing physical therapy um, and physical therapy is helping. My neck is still, you know, I'm getting a little better. I'm trying to avoid surgery at all costs. I was going to jump into surgery um, early on, but I decided that I'm not going to do surgery. So I'm basically just trying, I'm doing physical therapy twice a week. You know, my neck is kind of messed up and through here I have three herniated discs in my neck and one in my lower back. So my lower back is definitely giving me some problems. I appreciate that, man. It, you know, I have so many people in India that watch me. I think, how would you guys feel if I did a tour, if I went to India, but I wouldn't know where to go in India, to be honest with you. Man bun undercut. I mean, honestly, that's not really going to change. Like, it's just a regular undercut with a man bun, <laughs> to be honest with you. Like, I don't think anything really is going to change from that, you know, um, whether it's 1985 or 2018. Slimy, what's going on? So, uh, I appreciate the uh, one person that's watching. No. <laughs> yeah, this is just random. I just wanted to go live. But, um, Chili, how you doing, man? How you guys doing? Chile, yeah, that's awesome. Mumbai, huh? Is that the place to go, Mumbai? See, I have to go and I have to probably charge people for haircuts. Like I do like a, a haircut. Um, I'm pretty expensive here in the United States. 
You know, hey guys doing? I'm hanging in there, Lawrence. I'm hanging in there. Thank you, Eduardo. I appreciate that. So if you guys are just joining me, this is my new product. It's called Slick. And it's a very pliable, user-friendly pomade. Look at this, man. Amazing. You'd be the first to have this out if you purchase it. 30% uh, off for Black Friday sale starts at midnight, which is uh, USA Eastern Time here. It's about an hour away. Gustavo, what's going on? Yeah, it's been a while since I've seen a lot of people. I haven't been, I've been really, you know, this injury I have has, been, has affected me, but I'm telling you, man. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm doing 30% off. I'm not giving away any free stuff, unfortunately. But 30% um, off at midnight. Code BLACK30. BLACK30. TheSalonGuy.com slash shop. All right? 30% is a lot, to be honest with you. You know, I've never done a sale 30% off. So, nice hair, Lawrence. Nice hair. Has anybody gotten the new COD? or Battlefront 2, because I've been obsessed with Battlefront and COD. That's it, Jose, Black 30, that's it. <laughs> like Zero Dark 30, this is Black 30. Is anyone playing the new COD? Or the new Battlefront? Oh, Evan, I appreciate that. I appreciate that. The first Battlefront, oh man, I'm on Xbox. The first battle, you gotta get Battlefront 2. And the new COD, the new COD is sick. Yeah, it's sick. Yeah. Oh, that's cool, man. Yeah, Lawrence, it's really, it's pretty amazing, to be honest with you, pretty amazing. How to deal with frizzy hairs. Wavy, thick, look, Vishnu. Um, go on my YouTube channel and search how to smooth hair, or how to get smooth hair. Like, I've done videos on this. Yeah, COD is probably the same thing on PS4 than, and Xbox. It's probably, like, literally the same, to be honest with you. You know? Probably the same. So, is anybody even here from the United States? Uh, it depends. So, what I do is I get um, a tester, and then I'll... You know, I'll talk to the manufacturer, tell them what I'm, you know, looking for, or we'll talk, and then all of a sudden they'll send me, oh, cool, man, awesome, oh, sweet, and then um, they'll send me a sample, I'll test it, and if I like it, then move forward, if I don't like it, then, you know, sometimes there's changes, like sometimes I'll pick out a fragrance, um, I'm actually working on a completely new line, I found this new manufacturer. I'm coming up with these really luxurious items, stuff that I've never done before. Uh, I've been picking out fragrances. I've been testing stuff. I've been really, really uh, doing some really crazy stuff. And, um, you know, so I have some really good stuff coming out. Like, that's going to blow your mind. Um, <laughs> actually, I do have a little bit of a secret. I do... Oh, Oklahoma City, what's going on? Yeah, ha hair brain, huh? That's awesome. Um, oops, sorry about that. And uh, I've been, what the hell was I saying? Yeah, hair brain is cool. I don't really do any hair, any stuff on hair brain anymore, but uh, I know um, Rudy, who's awesome. Um, let me see. What was I saying about, oh, and then, and then if I like them, we'll put them in, in a production, and then it takes, I'd say a couple of weeks, and then depending on where, um, there's like a whole bunch of process, like I have to come up with everything on the packaging, the text, you know, uh, it's got to be approved, and then once it passes approval, then it goes into production, but um, that's pretty much it. So I'm glad to see so many people here from the United States. That's awesome. Uh, if you're just joining us again at midnight, 30% off. 30% off, man. Just, you better, like, my, I think I, people are waiting for this because, like, I've been noticing, like, not a lot of sales are going on because I've been promoting this Black Friday deal, like, the last couple of weeks. 
I think I'm going to get slammed tonight at midnight. I hope. That's why I'm up right now. India. Everybody always asks questions. Why does my hair fall down? Well, one, because you're probably not using the right product. And two, because it might be too long. You know? Um, best product for thick, wavy hair? It depends on the type of hold you want, Eduardo. If you want, like, a really good, strong hold, then power cream, that is the way to go. Excuse me. Power cream is literally a very strong holding cream gel. Everybody with really thick hair, a lot of um, Spanish guys and, you know, Middle Eastern guys are Asian, really thick hair. Power cream is like an amazing cream gel. If you want really like firm hold, like you put this stuff in and you know, it's gonna stay there like all day and it gives a little volume too. Power cream is a big, big seller for me. I do ship to India, but the problem is, is sometimes it, get it gets lost in the mail and shipping is very expensive. So, I mean, I do ship there, but like a lot of times the post office, um, the post office will hold it and then people don't know about that and they'll ask me where it is. I'll go check with the post office and the post office will hold on to it because they want you to pay like a tax on it. So, you know, I do ship out in other countries, but if you're in Europe, I do have um, my stuff listed on mocure.com, M-O-Q-U-E-R.com. They're actually located in the Netherlands, so they ship out all in Europe. Yeah, Scott. I actually have a mini sea salt spray. I have a two ouncer, which is actually uh, a lot cheaper. Um, so yeah. Do you have to have short hair to fix your hairline? What do you mean by that? What products do you use when you're growing out your hair? It depends, Vishnu. It depends what time, what kind of, kind of style you want. I don't know. It really depends. I already ate. It's actually 11 p.m. in USA right now. 11 p.m. So I already ate my Thanksgiving like a while ago already. <laughs> if you want a Mariano DeVaio haircut or any type of haircut, show your barber a photo. That's it. I've done videos on this. What to tell your barber for a haircut. What to ask your barber. Show a photo. Um, some hair in the front or short. Uh, you just gotta, I don't know, just grow it out. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Um, yeah, post office stinks, man. Whoa, that's sick. What's that, Gustavo? Trim my pubes and send a picture. Um, I'm not a pube barber. Uh, I only do underarm hair, but, um, yeah, I don't do pube barbering, but there are pube barbers. Check them out. You can also go on YouTube and type in pube hair tutorials, see what happens. Uh, what do you want to ask me, Gustavo? <laughs> How do you stop your hairline from growing in? Um, shave it. Yeah, that's what a lot of barbers do. They shave a hairline. They, sh they do like a, they cut it straight across. So have them shave it <laughs> and create like a straight line. That's the best way to do it. I appreciate that, Vishnu. And again, I'm, I apologize for not making the amount of hair videos I used to. It's just tough for me. With my, I don't want to. I don't want to try to attempt to make a haircut tutorial. I just don't feel right. It really sucks, man. This freaking injury has like gotten the best of me. So it's painful to not be able to put out videos like I've been. You know, it's really, really sucks because you guys are all amazing, and you know, I have over twelve hundred, almost I think twelve hundred videos on YouTube. I've been on YouTube for eight and a half years. And uh, so there's a lot of stuff you can go and watch. I got injured at my gym. Um, July 29th, I had a bad injury at my gym. I was doing an exercise with these straps and the straps ripped and I fell flat on my back and my head hit the, hit the ground and my neck snapped. So I have three herniated discs in my neck, two here, one here, and then one in my lower back. So I'm doing physical therapy. I'm able to move a little bit more. But I used to work out four or five times a week, and I haven't worked out since July 29th, which is really horrible. <laughs> really, really horrible. All right. Am I making good money doing what? 
yes, I make decent money because I have my own business. Um, I have herniated discs in my neck, Doc. I have three in my... Um, Oh yes, I'm already yeah. It's a, I'm, I'm already going after it. It's a case. I have a lawyer and everything. Yeah, Gustavo, but that, that stuff takes a while. To be honest with you, I, I'm still not even ready yet. But Doc, I have three herniated discs in my neck and one in my um, lumbar spine, L5 S1. Uh, one doctor suggested surgery on my lower back, a fusion. I don't know if you guys are doing fusions over there, but a fusion for my neck and a fusion for my back. I just don't want to do that. I'm trying physical therapy. I'm getting the um, steroid injections, the, the epidural injection shots. I'm going to try that and see if that helps and physical therapy. And if that doesn't work, then I have to have surgery. So net neutrality, I don't even know what that is. For men, I like kind of like a short cropped, like maybe two inch, three inches on top, kind of a tapered look, something that you can kind of create like a messy style. Um, Hugo, I, I appreciate that, Vishnu. Um, wait, what was that question again? How to keep long, thin hair up without damaging it and not using hairspray? You need some sort of product, honestly, Hugo. Like, I have my product, Talc. Talc is amazing for fine hair. Like, amazing. You dab it in, and you can style it literally any way you want, you know? But... A hair dryer, I mean, if your hair is wet, you have to dry it somehow. It's not going to stay up. It's just going to lay flat. That's just the way hair is. Like, you need to dry it in order to get volume. There's no other way around it. I mean, happy Thanksgiving, Eric. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Uh, it was good, thanks. It's uh, just past 11 p.m. So at 12 midnight tonight, an hour away, I'm doing my Black Friday sale on all my hair products 30% off, code BLACK30, thesalonguy.com slash shop. Um, affordable hair dryer? I mean, I'd say just go on Amazon. There's plenty of good ones for like, I don't know, $30, $40. Like Chi, C-H-I is a good one. Hair styles for thin hair and what product is good? Fiber, wax, or pomade? Um, for thin hair, I would stay away from a wax, I'd stay away from a fiber, and I'd stay away from a pomade. Because when your hair is thin, and anything wet makes it look thinner. So I would use something like talc, my matte styling powder. Um, so, that's it, man. I would say, like, something a little bit shorter, more cropped on top, you know? Yeah, I don't Phoenix, Flame Phoenix. Uh, <laughs> let's see here. I'm going to try to stream as long as I can. Uh, Eric, good question. Sea salt spray or pre-style for thicker hair, coarse five inches? My product, I have a product called pre-style, which is a mousse, a gel mousse. I would say that works really well. You get a lot of volume with pre-style. That's what it's designed for. Uh, pre-style is because I'm a hairstylist. I know what pre-stylers are actually supposed to do, so uh, I would suggest using pre-style if you want a lot of volume. Sea, my Tidal Wave sea salt spray, I would say, is good for getting some volume, volume as well, but I'd say pre-style gives maximum volume. Hairspray for fine hair, yeah, sure, that's fine. Hairspray just literally locks in the style, so that's it. Uh, Gustavo, that has nothing to do with anything. <laughs> I could have an afro or I could have a shaved head. It doesn't matter. It has nothing to do with cutting hair. I've been cutting hair for over 20 years. So it doesn't matter if I'm bald or not. Um, let's see. Oh, man. Fulfill your vibes. Thank you, man. You too. Oh, make tech vids. Appreciate you checking it out. Yeah, yeah, flat tech. That's sick. Necktie, what's going on? How you doing, man? Don't worry. Yeah, man. Oh, I appreciate that. It's okay, Gustavo. No problemo, amigo. <laughs> no problemo. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Anybody drink Monster right here? Um, honestly, 
Mm. You know what? I spent, that's sick. I've spent 20 years in this industry and um, I used to work for L'Oreal and I used to work for Paul Mitchell and I've worked with a lot of brands in the past and each has their own stuff, which is good, but I promote my products mostly because I'm a hairstylist and I've tested them and used them on clients. I've had stylists test them. I'm the real deal when it comes to actually, you know, being authentic. You know, I'm not just like a bedroom or bathroom blogger that has hair products that makes them in their kitchen. You know, I work with like big brands and, you know, the process I go through for testing, it's the real deal. I test them on my own clients. I have other hairstylists test them. So, you know, that's why I like promoting myself because I've tested it all. I charge 75. Um, yes, I've seen slick hair, of course. Uh, let's see. Mona Lisa. No something. My hair is a lot of volume. And I want to have an undercut. What undercut should you use? I mean, there's loads, man. LA is like, there's loads of guys in LA. Um, hold on. There was a good question. My hair is a lot of volume and I want to have an undercut. What undercut should I use? I mean, just get an undercut. You know, an undercut is really short and this is long. You know, get whatever you want, really. Just ha don't have them go too high, you know? <laughs> yeah, sorry, Gustavo. I charge 150 for women. Um, a good hairstyle for curly hair, Eduardo? I mean, it all really depends on how you want to wear your hair, you know? Like, I would say something cropped, maybe an inch and a half, two inches on top, so you can kind of slick it back. I think curly hair have it at least maybe two to three inches on top because you can slick it back. You can do creative stuff with it, you know, maybe have a nice taper on the sides and have it go into a little bit longer on top. Um, let's see, going bald. I say probably about 20 minutes ago, I started going bald. Um, <laughs> my favorite hairstyle? Ugh. Oh. I don't know, I do like just like textured, messy, kind of spiked haircut, you know? I really appreciate you guys sitting on with me this whole time. This is really cool. Yeah, there's no hope for my, there's hope for my chest hair, that's about it. But not for my ha hair in my head. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you see, um, recently my old stylist stopped responding to me and he got super busy. I switched to another guy, stylist, and... Oh, man, that sucks, Eric. Okay, you should grow it out. That's good. You should grow it out, man. No, Gustavo, I like the interaction, man. Yeah, Eric. Yeah, something like Zayn Malik is cool. Yeah, Vishnu. Here's the difference between um, barbers and hairstyles. I actually did a video. Oh, man. Thank you, Clayton. Green Capman, how you doing? Here's the difference between uh, I'm in I'm in the United States, Eduardo. So um, the comb, ooh, you don't want to blow dry with a comb. That's horrible. Yeah, go to a salon. Okay, here's the difference: with barber shops and salons. Barbers are amazing. I mean, they're very talented. They do great clipper work. You know, I've noticed. That once you start to get anything where the hair is a little bit longer on top, like two inch, three inches, four inches, it all really depends on the guy. But sometimes they're not the greatest. And I've seen a lot of hack jobs from barbers. They're great at like fades and stuff. But when it comes, if you want like a long sweeping flow, you want longer hair, like a surfer haircut or longer Justin Bieber, go to a hairstylist, I would suggest. And if you want like a really close kind of tight fade, you know, the edge ups, all the lineups and everything crazy, like designs, barbers are like really good at that. But now you're coming out with, I mean, there's hybrids. Like I consider myself a hybrid, right? A hybrid is someone who's good with clippers, who can do decent fades, but also really good with scissors. So I'm technically trained as a hairstylist. Like, you know, so I can dissect really bad haircuts and fix them because of my extensive training 
and what I've learned. And that's why I'm expensive. That's why I spend an hour for my haircuts with men and women. And I take my time and the haircut speaks for itself. Like, not to say I'm the best in the world, but I, I spend a lot of time. I do most, I do some clipper work, but I do a lot of stuff by hand. And that's the difference. So go to a hair salon, which a hair salon is someone who does, they do men and women. All right. But there's a lot of horrible hairstyles out there too. So, you know, <laughs> what do you call the lines besides your head? Um, those are like hard parts or just like design lines. That's what they're called. Talented, but quite uncomfortable being in the seat with him since he's known. Um, it's quite uncomfortable being in the seat with him since he's known as being a little not all there. Look, Grayson, if he does a good job, then keep going to him. But like, you know, like look around. The best thing to do is to go on Instagram and see who's like in your area. That's it. Go on Instagram and search and find people who are in your area and look at their work. Like just go hashtag whatever town you're from, whatever on Instagram and see what comes up or hashtag town, hashtag barber and find guys and look at their work on Instagram. There's a lot of people posting their work on Instagram. Check them out. Yeah, Eric, go try a woman's salon. But like I said, check out the salon, look at the stylists, do some research. Don't just walk into a place, find out if there's any stylists there or barbers. This goes for everybody. If, there, are there, if there's barbers, if there's stylists, go in and check them out and see if they can do the kind of cuts you want. That's, that's what I suggest. Steven, how you doing? I, I started going bald about 15 minutes ago. Yeah. Thick wavy hair. Um, green cabin. It depends what you want. What kind of look you want. Um, thick wavy hair. And I still my hair slick back pump. It, you know, I have my product called Power Cream. If you want an extreme strong hold, Power Cream is the way to go. That will like lock in, be bulletproof. Um, my new product right here is called Slick. Literally, like this, I just got this in. This is gonna be, this is sick. Very, very sick pomade, man. Um, doesn't give a like super strong hold, but a very pliable, workable hold. And then my, this has a pretty decent shine to it. Very, very good shine. Really, really unique product. And then my product Haze, which is a fan favorite. Um, Haze has a little more hold, very, very workable. Uh, but I'd say Slick is a really good choice. Oh, thanks, man. Slick Nick, there we go. Dude, don't forget, at midnight, 30% off the Black Friday sale starts. Code BLACK30. BLACK30, 30% off. And please, I'm telling you, if you want to buy products, man, stock up. Like, I mean, if you want to buy one, that's cool. But take advantage of the sale, dude. 30% off. I've never done a sale this high before, ever. Um, techniques to prevent baldness and maintain hair strength. Don't wear a lot of hats. If you wear baseball hats, I'm telling you, I used to do that a lot and my corners started to go. So be careful with wearing a lot of baseball hats. Um, what maybe get into the hair industry, girls, <laughs> hair products from you, the salonguy.com slash shop. Um, I'm telling you, Matt, man, I'm, I'm hoping sooner than later, man, this really sucks. Oh, thanks a lot, man. Hello there, Kid Harrison Dell. No. Uh, I have a shampoo called Fortify. It literally thickens your hair and it promotes healthy, like thicker hair growth. It's amazing. Fortify shampoo and conditioner. With a leave in treatment spray, but yes, dude, Eric, my product 25 literally is a game changer. 25 is a friggin' game changer if you have damage or dry hair. Couple of spritzes, dude, the stuff is locked in, man. It's sick. Yes, Hank from Breaking Bad, that's funny. <laughs> Hello there, how are you? Gaming, so gaming manjong. Um, since you're, it must be a gamer, have you gotten the new Battlefield? Or I'm sorry, Battlefront, have you gotten the new COD? I'm playing both of them. Coconut oil, two times daily on your five-inch beard. Wow, man, that's sick. 
Uh, you know, it really depends what you want your beer to do. If you have like one of those long beards, coconut oil, it's gonna make it smell nice, but it's gonna make it oily. I mean, coconut oil is a, kind of a greasy product. So, I mean, I even eat coconut oil, it's healthy for you. But, um, you know, it's gonna make your beard very kind of whack, almost waxy and like, so you need something like, it depends on how you want your beard to look. Um, how did I get into being a hairstylist? I'm tempted, oh man, Grayson, you know, it's tough. I got into hairstyling a long time ago because I had a crush on a girl who worked at a hair salon. <laughs> We're talking 28 years ago. Um, you gotta convince your parents of your passion. That's it. Uh, yes, Eric, this is going to be um, streamed live. Eric, what was your question? Let me go back. Um, yes, Eric, my product 25 is amazing. My hair, my uh, 25 spray, the leave-in spray, if your hair is damaged, it's literally a game-changing product. 25 is crazy. So, um, everyone's hair has a natural part. Some guys, some people have a part here, some people have a part here, some people have a part down the middle. So if he's slicking it back, uh, it might not be long enough, but what you have to do is you kind of have to go over in a different direction and come in the side and then back because the hair wants to split. So try combing it kind of a little more on an angle and um, the way you brush it, you have to manipulate it a little bit more. And also use a, a good product that's gonna help lock it in, something a little bit heavy. 25, yeah man, it's sick. Uh, 25 is a leave-in treatment spray with 25 benefits to it. So if your hair is a little bit damaged or it's dry or if you want something that's going to be a great leave-in treatment so your hair feels nice and healthy, that's what it does. So it's got like heat protecting agents. It's kind of like it has um, ingredients that help protect from the sun, like sunflower extract. So if you're out in the sun a lot, your hair doesn't get damaged. Um, it helps defrizz your hair. It helps smooth your hair. It helps prevent flyaways, which is really, really good if you have a lot of flyaways. It's great for detangling. You spray it on and you can comb right through it. If you're a hairstylist, uh, it's a great cutting lotion. You spray it and you can actually use it to help keep the hair moist and cut. Um, it helps lock in the style as well. So it actually deposits onto the hair strands and locks it in so that when you're blow drying it and then you, or you're putting other product over it, it helps support that style. So it helps you um, with locking in the style, which is really, really good. It adds a little bit of volume to it. Um, it actually uh, conditions your hair. It helps, it's got biotin, so it's good and healthy and strong. So um, Joshua, it depends what kind of style you want. A lot of people with curly hair or thick hair like my product Power Cream because it's a really strong holding cream gel. Like it's legit. Uh, I don't know, he looks like he has like a four, like a three or four. I know, Eric, man, I don't get it. And I appreciate that. I mean, like, you know, that's sick. Here's the thing is these guys have nice hair. They have good looks. They have rich families, rich friends. That's it. I mean, they live the life. They can afford to do stuff. But they basically are known simply because of their haircuts. I mean, that's it. They're not hairstylists. You know, if you want to promote hair stuff, you want to get make hair products, you want to talk like you're a hair expert, get your cosmetology license. Like, I'll call out anybody. I don't give a crap. Like, you know what I mean? I've spent tens of thousands of dollars on going to school. I've trained 20-something years of my life in the beauty industry. Dude, like, come at me, man. Like, fucking, I'm sorry. Like, don't promote, like, you know, I see all these people giving hair advice and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, dude, like, you're, you're jumping into my world. You know, it's like me calling myself a pharmacist because I think I know drugs and stuff like that for people. And a pharmacist who went to pharmacy school and is a farm tech, like farm technician, don't, you know, don't like fucking sit there and say you, you're a pharmacist. Wait, what is this? Kitty fiddler? What the hell does that mean, Rogue State? Thank you. Um, David Beckham's cool. You know what I mean? Kitty fiddler. Like, I don't even know what that means. Uh, so... Cutting hair, I love using my craft and using my skill to transform people. 
and to make them look and feel amazing. That's it. I don't know anything in India, man. Like, I don't know Vishnu, like, no idea, you know? Jose, thank you, man. I appreciate that. So for those of you just joining me at midnight, which is like 20, actually like 40 minutes or so from now, Black Friday sale starts, code BLACK30, 30% 30 off. It's going to be sick. I think I'm going to get slammed at midnight, man, because I'm telling you, I think people are waiting. I would say stock up because, you know, it's going to be awesome. <laughs> so what is going on? Yes, Steven, it's hard to cut people's hair, man. It's not easy. I've been doing it for a long time. It's like it's easy to me, but even sometimes I find it difficult. Yes, Mona Lisa, like I've mentioned before, depends on what you're looking for. So curly hair, I have power cream, which is amazing. I have hair whip if you want something really light. Um, Tidal Wave is great for curly hair. Are you male or female, Mona Lisa? I'm assuming you're female. I'm from USA. Do you, do you guys speak Hindi or Punjabi? Like, what are you guys, where are you guys from? Is it, how do you say hello? Is it namaste? Is that the same thing for like Punjabi? Thin straight hair should avoid doing undercut. Not really. I've done undercuts on guys with thin, thin straight hair. I think it looks pretty good. Make curly hair straight with just a blow dryer. Yes. <laughs> That's funny, Steven. I appreciate that. Hard muck. Yes. Um... I'm coming out with one, it's a new beta product that I'm working on that's a really strong hold. I have um, Stinger Paste is good, Bond Paste is good, my, my product Talc is good. Hello from Bangkok, how you doing? How are you? Uh, my first business, um, high volume for fine hair, yes Danny. My product, talc. Talc powder is my number one selling product. And it's not like actual talc, like the one that everyone freaks out about. I just named it talc. Talc is friggin' amazing. Talc is like insane for fine hair. You dab it on, you can squeeze it, it's like a powder. Your hair will literally do anything. It's nuts. So how do you say... I can't even pronounce Vishnu. I can't even pronounce that. <laughs> Steven, um, it's it's starting any business is not the easiest, to be honest with you. But uh, you know. All right. So how do you so what is there a big how do you say hello? Is it is hello like namaste the same in Hindi or Punjabi? Is it the same? Hello in Brazil. Obrigado. <laughs> How are you? Here it is. Hot off the press. Just came, I just got this in the mail. Look at that, man. Uh, yeah, Matt, I know who they are. Totally. My website, thesalonguy.com slash shop. Code BLACK30 starts in like a half an hour on my website. 30% off. Black Friday sale. Can hairspray? Yes. Hairspray can. Hairspray can dry your hair if you're using a really bad... Hairspray, trust me. I've seen it really damage people's hair. It becomes like really brittle. So yeah, hairspray can damage it <laughs> if you're not using a good one. I don't have a hairspray. I just came out with a dry shampoo not too long ago, which is really good. You're a male Mona Lisa, okay. You're like Mona Lisa with an undercut. Yes, um, I don't know. I know when this one was being formulated, 
they said that it's it's designed to outperform that one. Um, that one came up as far as like a competitor kind of thing, but this was formulated to outperform that and a number of other ones. Um, Namaste. Okay, cool. How about Punjabi? Is it the same? Why does my hair look spiky even when I fully dry it? Could be damaged? Probably because it's too short. I mean, if your hair is like an inch long, it's going to look spiky. That's what happens. You know, hair spikes up because it's short. That's it. If your hair was like five inches, six inches, it would all go back and it would weigh down. Matt Damon on Good Will Hunting. I'm, I'm actually taking a break from haircutting tutorials until I feel a little better, to be honest with you. Second Nature. Oh, man, thank you. I appreciate that. Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, you know, I love, I love you guys so much, and I appreciate the interaction. It's been I, – I just – I miss my day-to-day -day grind like I've been doing. So I was like, you know what? I got to jump on here, man. You know, I'm really – just announcing my Black Friday sale. It starts at about a half an hour, 30% off on all my hair products, everything on my shop. Um, Slick just came in, which is awesome. Slick is awesome. Uh, I'm trying, Eric. I'm getting a little better. I'm doing physical therapy. I'm getting the epidural shots probably soon to help. If that doesn't work, then thank you, Mona Lisa. I appreciate that. Uh, I'm hanging in there, man. I'm hanging in there. What time is it where everybody is right now? If you're in the United States, obviously I know. But uh, I had a bad accident at my gym. Uh, I never really talked to him, to be honest with you, Intermix. Like, like I was never part of his crew or like, you know what I mean? Like, I, don't, I never really like, we interacted a couple times. But, uh, oh man, 828, wow. In the afternoon... West Coast, what's up, Josh? I'm on the East Coast. I have United States is number one, then I go to UK, then Canada, and then India. <laughs> um, 10 a.m., wow. Despacito. That's a sick song. <laughs> 10 a.m., wow, man, that's crazy. 10.30. Awesome. Chicago, Eric. Canada. Yeah, Mona Lisa, I'm not a barber. I'm a hairstylist, but um, yeah, I, I see private appointments. Matt, scratch my beard. <laughs> yeah, it's a little itchy. Um, Long-term injuries, a hernia, I have herniated discs. I have three in my neck and one on my back. So permanent damage is like herniations never go away here. You know what I mean? So, hey, Lawrence, how you doing? But that's what happened. I had a bad fall. Between a barber and a hair, Steven, literally, go to my YouTube channel and search that. I actually made a video, and I just actually just talked about that whole thing like 20 minutes ago. Um, literally, barbers versus hairstyles. I did a video and explained all of that. Eduardo, hello, Pablo Escobar. Oh, my God, Pablo Escobar is back from the dead. Um, yes, I have my own studio. No, man. No, Matt. Thank you, Stephen. I appreciate that. Yes, Brizovit. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. I have my own studio, which we're in right now. We're in right now. So let's let's flip the camera around. Let's take a look. So this is my studio. This is my... I'm. How many of you guys are Mac people? I'm a Mac guy. Um, I'm a Mac guy, and uh, how many of you are Mac or PC? Just just type it in, Mac or PC. Mac, all right. Mac, Bangladesh, Mac, Windows, all right. Windows. That's sick. Seems like a lot of Mac guys are here. Um, this is my studio. This is where I film all my videos and stuff. So here's my white background. Look at this. This is my studio. Yes, Matt. This is it. Yup. This is my studio, the Salon Guy Studios. PC. I use Final Cut Pro. 
You know, uh, is it real? I haven't traveled in a long time. How much does the building cost? Well, I'm renting it, you know? I'm renting it, so... It's pretty expensive. <laughs> Here is... Check this out. Here's my sinks and stuff like that. So I've got these sinks when I need them, you know? Uh, Final Cut is like... I think it's like two ninety nine, to be honest with you. Yeah, it's about two ninety nine. And in less, and hopefully a half an hour from now, and there's more. Here's my warehouse back here. It's kind of a mess, but here's my warehouse. Um, this is where I have meetings and stuff like that. And so I've got boxes everywhere. I've got products everywhere. Diamond Black Fan, how you doing? Uh, yes, I live alone. Yes, Matt. I have, I'm actually not open to the public. Let me switch this around. I'm actually not like a salon open to the public, uh, but I do training seminars here. And um, thank you, Rudra, Rudra. I appreciate that, Rudra. I uh, do haircutting training seminars here. I do video shoots for brands. You know, I shoot my own stuff here. I'll see private appointments only. Thank you, man. I, I, I appreciate that on the shirt compliment. <clears throat> I see private appointments, and uh, you know a lot of people from YouTube. You know, why do you why are you saying that? Um, it's Lorenz, Panama. How you doing? Hello, like Asian person, Anthony or wait, I, I'm oh Japanese. How are you? What do you mean, uh, Ar Arian? I have done some celebrities and stuff. Yes, I know who they are, but I mean, what about them? What about him? Uh, Kate, how are you? What's going on? Uh, look, everyone. I'm streaming, not, not in my bald head, but look. Oh, uh, I don't even know, man. I mean, I actually met Anthony, I cut his hair. I cut Anthony's hair a while ago. I did like, I think two or three videos with Anthony. Um, he's a nice dude from Canada, Blue, Blue Mon. I barely even talked to him. Like, I think I've interacted with him like twice. <laughs> so I don't really like, I mean, I know what he does, but um, I have cigar fully option. Thank you. Kate, where are you from? What country are you from? Damn Daniel. <laughs> Yeah, you saw that video I did? <laughs> Damn, Daniel. <laughs> okay, how many of you guys... I did. I used to work out five, four or five times a week, and I had a bad injury at the gym. Um, so, Frank Einstein, you guys like Frank? So, I haven't worked out in like a couple of months, but yeah, I do work out and stuff. I mean, you know, it's been a while, but I'm losing a lot of muscle because I haven't worked out, but yes, I do like working out. Uh, it just really sucks. I have no idea, I don't talk with him at all, Vishnu. Nothing, like, again, I don't really, I don't really interact with people who aren't um, professionals, like in the same industry as me that are promoting hair stuff and they're not professionals. I just like, they could be the nicest people, but I just like, I'm going to just talk to them and be like, why are you even doing what you're doing? Like, you know what I mean? Like, that's just my opinion. So I only associate myself with people who I can relate to, you know? Like, I respect people as people and I wish them the best, but it's like, I'd just be like, what's, like, what's up? You know what I mean? <laughs> uh, let's see here. Any tips, any tips to achieve thicker hair if the hair is thinning? Yes. Uh, Matt, I don't think it'll ever die. Um, achieve thicker hair, it's really products. Products and a good haircut, but products are what help get thicker hair, you know? <laughs> Diamond. Um, intermix, I had an injury at the gym. No, I've never been to, to Japan. Rick's hair from Rick and Morty. <laughs> I've never been to Japan, no. So we are going on 50 minutes of this live stream. Hello. 
What's Lauren's, man? I hope you uh, check out some of my stuff. I've never been to Canada, and, and Canada's awesome. I need to go there. Oh, you know why? Um, Lorenzo, sorry, man. Still 30%. At 40%, literally, I would, I'd be losing money, to be honest with you. Um, I've done Virat Kohli. Shampooing every day, is it still fine to condition every day and shampoo three to four days will it still cleanse? Yeah, but also uh, I have my new product, Dust, which is a dry shampoo. So that's where dry shampoo comes in, Eric. Um, Dust is a really, really sick dry shampoo. Cash out of 40. Ah, yeah, Lorenzo, man, I'd be broke, dude. I'd be like, I would lose money. Like, I can't. You know what I mean? Uh, $21.99, I believe. But it, again, it's going to be 30% off. So in about 25 minutes, that's when my Black Friday sale starts. Go for it, man. I would say stock up on whatever you can. I'm doing it all day tomorrow. You know what I mean? All starting in midnight. I, I, I'm, gonna, I'm telling you, man, I'm praying. Praying that I have a good sale because I never offered 30% off. <laughs> 30% off is a lot, <laughs> to be honest with you. But everybody does Black Friday sales, so why not, you know? My favorite rapper? Hmm. I would say... Is it okay to use printer ink to dye your hair? I would stay away from that. Best hairstyle? I don't know, man. Hmm, that's a good one. Hold on. Argentina, hola, como estas? Mateo. Um, uh, let's see. My favorite rapper. Oh, this is old school. Big Daddy Kane. Uh, I'm a Ronaldo guy, man. So I like Real Madrid. I would never do that. <laughs> I'm a Real Madrid. I guess I like Real Madrid, to be honest with you. You know, I'm a, I'm a Ronaldo guy. So, hey, Brandon, how you doing? Lorenzo, not really. You know, it's poison. Printer ink is poisonous. Like, it's it's harsh chemical, you know. Bien to... Mucho, mucho gusto, I appreciate that. Thank you. No, I'm not a cricketer. I did learn... I did play learn how to play cricket a long time ago. Thank you, Briggs. I appreciate that, man. Yes. That's awesome. Yeah, I did three years. Whoop. I did three years um, firefighting, about three years law enforcement, and I ended my career as a fugitive recovery agent after 9 11. But I actually started in the salon industry first. I left the salon industry because I wanted to be a hero. And that's when I did all that stuff for about six years. And then after 9 11, I got out. Um, I actually watched my video on what happened to me in 9 11. You know what I mean? Like, that's a pretty sick... Um, no hablo español. Hablo poquito. <laughs> uh, watch my video, What Happened to Me in 9-11. Kaijo, how you doing, man? Thank you for spelling my name right. I appreciate that. Dude, I, I mean, we're going on almost an hour. Uh, holy crap. Um, what do you think? Greg Brzezinski? I don't know who that is. Oh. I was trained as a first responder. Amar, thank you very much. I have loads of haircuts for women, like loads. Oh man, are you from Jersey, Briggs? Cause I'm in New Jersey. Not really. The best hair perming. Oh, dude, I'm in New I'm in New Jersey too. Who are you with? Oh, Stephen, dude, I'm from New I'm from New Jersey. You know what I mean? Um, Briggs, who are you with? No, I don't do perms. Oh, North Bergen, cool. Virat Coley, I have to look. Yeah, dude, so Briggs, you were there. I mean, you know what happened. 9-11, man. I don't know what you were doing, but, man. Oh, wow, Captain, thank you. Thank you for your service, man. Damn, you look pretty young to be a, have been a captain. Um, good tip to grow out your hair. Just grow it out, you know? Thank you, Mar. Yes, search them. I have lots of women's haircuts. 
Yes, 30% off, Kate. Yes, Intermix, originally from Jersey. Uh, how to keep your hair really still? Like a really hard, firm holding gel. I have one called Power Cream. Yeah, there's a lot of Stevens. I spell my name S-T-E-P-H-E-N. Dude, we're almost going on an hour. Yes, I have thought of moving to LA. There's a lot of stuff in LA, you know what I mean, that I need to be, I need to do out there. Uh, use candle wax to keep your hair in place. Brazilian blowout, relaxers, and short, thick, coarse, dry hair. I mean, keratins are probably the safest. Oh, man, yeah, that's 20, yeah, 20 now as a captain. Did you get 70% when you got out? That's the max you can get at 70%, I think. 50. Oh, man. How come you only got 50? That's weird. Dance steps. <laughs> No, I'm not dancing right now. Stiff Asian hair, stay up. You need a product, man. You mean a good product? Oh, cool, Vishnu. I appreciate that. Christy. Oh, wait a second, North Bergen. That's right. A lot of guys up north got um, laid off. Like Jersey City. I know a lot of cops. Well, actually, I know a lot of cops that get laid off. You know. Uh, I can't really do push-ups right now because of my injury. I have bad herniated discs in my neck and back. You know, 25 years. So that's currently? I thought it was 70%, man. 70%. Jacob, I would say power cream. Power cream literally is this, is this cream gel. It's like bulletproof, and it's amazing. Really, Brandon? You tried power cream? Power cream is um, strong holding gel, man. I'm telling you, that stuff is strong holding gel. Tips for young entrepreneurs, be patient and work for it. Don't sit around and complain. Work for it and be patient. Now, once you put that in, Jacob, it's pliable in the beginning. But then once you're done, dude, it starts to lock in and firm up. You know, it's hard to have, it's impossible to have super strong hold and be pliable. Like, it's pretty tough, you know. It's a cream gel. Also, if you're just joining me, in about 15 minutes starts my Black Friday sale, code BLACK30 for 30% off. The salonguy.com slash shop. 30% off everything. So I would say go crazy, buy everything. <laughs> um, Tej Hanley, Yes. Yes, David, I ship to Canada all the time. Eric, man, I appreciate that, Eric. And check out some other products, Pre-Style 25. I mean, you can go nuts. Take advantage of the sale. You know what I mean? Like, one product's cool, but like, you know, it's going to last all day, Jose. All of Black Friday. Yep, and 25 too. All Black Friday. I'm literally going to ship them out tomorrow. <clears throat> Uh, my mannequins are all sleeping right now. <laughs> I have so many damn mannequins. Is there a better comb than a Kent comb? I don't know. Uh, intermix, not really. I don't really know him too well. Like, I know of him, and I think we had, like, one small interaction, but, like, I'm not friends with him. Like, you know what I mean? Robin Brand Battle with Your Earth Clay. Oh, man, that was a long time ago. You know, I literally at one point was winning 5-0, I think. But I don't think he used... Because I've used Earth Clay plenty of times. And, like, I don't know. I don't think he used it properly. Because when I've used it, it completely functioned differently than his. Like, it looked like his hair was kind of, like, messy and, like, dirty to start with. So I just don't... I don't know, man. Yes, PewDiePie has shouted me out. Uh, I've interacted with him on a number of live streams. Uh, Mayan, how are you? Bye, Eric. Uh, my Thanksgiving was good, thank you. How about yours? I ate a lot. <laughs> I'm also moving into a brand new apartment. And I started attempting to vlog. I'm trying to do some vlog stuff. Like, I don't know. Dude, I appreciate We're going on literally... Almost an hour of this live stream. Like an hour. So I'll tell you. Four, three, two, one. 60 minutes. It's officially an hour. 
that I've had this live stream going an hour. That's crazy. And thank you for the people that have stayed on here. There's really not a lot of people, but I do appreciate everyone who's been on here like this whole time. Um, Mona Lisa, I'm sorry, I should what? <laughs> That's where working out helps. Um, is there a way to make my hair less stiff? I mean, what do you mean by stiff? Like stiff means it would probably just stand straight up all the time. You need something like softening, like my product um, Plush. It's a smoothing product. Thank you, Amar. I appreciate that. Amar, are you from India as well? Clippers for fading? Yeah, Briggs, you know? Like, it depends what you're looking for, but I have a lot of stuff, man. Take advantage of the sale, dude. It starts. Um, yes. It'll help improve your hairstyle and make your hair healthier. Have I been able to make the new cutting video? Oh, thank you, man, Steven. I appreciate it. Magic clips. I use, yeah, exactly. That's what I use. Any fitness YouTubers? Yes, um, I do. Hello there, Anna. Problem with YouTubers like Man From Soft. No, that's cool. I mean, people can review products. That's fine, Jacob. Um, killer Clippers, yeah. Every day. You can wear hair products every day. That's fine. What hair color do you recommend? It depends. Thank you. My beard is short right now, to be honest with you. Um, I appreciate that, Lawrence, man. And we're, I'm gonna, do you want me to stay on with you till the sale starts? Let me know. Let me know if you want me to stay on for another 10 minutes with you guys. <laughs> um, no. Thank you. So you, if, if you've tried power cream, there's no way your hair flops down. Trust me. Power cream is ridiculously strong hold. Like, insanely strong. Like, it's, you, it's, it becomes really firm. Cody, thank you, man. Whoa, I don't even know what that means. Oh, thank you, Briggs. I appreciate that. Recommend you would use dandruff shampoo before switching back to a regular one. And use it until your dandruff is gone. But this is my... Check this out. Since you guys... I'm 43. Uh, yes, so look at this. This is my arsenal right here of stuff. So I've got a feather razor right here. I have, this is my shaving razor. Again, it's a feather one, but this has no guard on it. All right. This is my comb. This is a YS Park hair cutting comb. Really, really good comb. Um, here is one pair of my thinning shears. Um, by Hanzo. Here's another pair of my shears. These are 6.5 inch. Yes, Jose. This is another um, shear I use a lot for barbering. And I have my own shears right here. Look at that. I have my own scissors and these are, these have some hair on them, unfortunately. Let me clean these guys off. Here we go. Here's my scissors right here. These are handcrafted. I didn't handcraft them because I don't know how to make shears, but I picked everything out to have these made. I wanted an affordable pair of shears. I literally use these every single day. When I, if I do cut hair, um, I hold my shears this way. Everybody always wants to know how I do that. When you're cutting, you want to make sure you're mostly moving the thumb like this. You want to make sure you're moving the thumb this way, see? And I flip it around this way. That's it, when I cut. Flip and cut. So a lot of people want to... I think it was like, gosh, back in the day it was like 13,000 or I, don't even, I, don't even, I forget. So I've got two types of um, blades. These are for my Oster clippers right here which are the detachable blades. And I've got all of the blades right here. Look at this. All of them are right here. This is the shortest guard. Oh, no, that's not the shortest guard. Here it is. Darwin, awesome. Bye, Kate. Thank you very much. Bye. 
This is the shortest right here. Five zeros. This is basically like the sh as short as you can go. This is like skin almost. You know? Yes, Raphael, I do have a hair cream. Support cream right here. Yeah, dude. I've got matte. I have triple zero. I've got four zeros right here. Here's the four zeros. And then I have five zeros, which I just showed you. Then I use these for the magic clip right here. Everybody who's a barber, you know these suckers right here. These are the ones. And I have these, these um, wall attachments, the metal ones. Oh. All right, what were you guys saying? Um, Mishra. I have no idea if that clay is any good, to be honest with you. In order for a fade, you start the lowest, the highest zeros, and you work your way up. Um, yes, barbering is a little bit different. How does a zero compare to a closed blade, no guard? Um, triple zero, that is basically blade, no guard. That's most triple zeros. I do ship to Bangladesh, but it's expensive and just, it might take some time to get there. Oh man, my phone is dying. I'm gonna have to connect my phone. But we've got like 10 minutes. We've got 10 minutes. Here's my uh, dry shampoo called Dust, which is new. Um, a fan, that's a good question. Am I a fan of home-brewed products? I mean, home-brewed products are cool, they're not, they're not FDA approved. Um, it's literally the dudes that are sitting there cooking in their kitchen. I mean, that's cool. It just depends on the scalability, but there's no actual regulatory process of home brewing. Like there's no sanitation methods. Like you can wear gloves and hats and stuff, but they're not FDA approved. I mean, that's it. <laughs> that is it. Let's see. Sorry, here we go. Um, making a point with me in the, f yeah, dude. Straight razor for shape ups. Wow. Yes, Matt. 10 minutes, man. 10 minutes. Um, MLP Sean, best brand product for medium hold and natural look. Honestly, this right here, slick is amazing. This just came in. It's a pomade, um, very workable. It's got good medium shine, a very unique pomade, very unique. Uh, my product Haze is really good. My favorite Star Wars character, oh man, I'm a Darth Vader guy, man. You know what I mean? I like Darth Vader, I like um, Luke Skywalker, I like Yoda. <laughs> I'm a big Yoda guy. The new Battlefront 2 is friggin' in excuse me, incredible. The new Battlefront 2 is incredible. I have to shave my hair, man. Like, this looks horrible. Like, hideous. Yes, of course, Matt. They're cruelty-free. Uh, a good amount are vegan. Um, yeah. Cody. Lasted for four months. Now it's slowly building, slowly but you're building my client base. Other than hustle and working as much as possible, any advice for a new stylist? Um, <laughs> advice for a new stylist is just practice as much as you can and get good at every single thing that you want to do. Like, that's it. And keep posting your work on Instagram. That's it, man. Practice, practice, practice. Gerard PK, I'm not doing any haircut tutorials right now. I'm an Xbox guy. I'm an Xbox guy. All right, so I'm going to jump on my computer here. Yep, cruelty-free, and like I said, some are vegan. Um, since you know what? I'm going to give you guys a sneak peek. Check this out. So, I'm working with a new luxury manufacturer. This is hot off the press. I'm coming out with candles. These are the most, oh my God, the fragrances on these are, I'm more of a FIFA guy. 
oh my god, tobacco, vanilla bean, saffron, like the fragrances in these are crazy. So one I'm calling Forest, which is, and this is just a sample um, design. Everyone who smelled these, men and women, are like, oh my god, the smell of this. These are soy candles. These are hand-poured soy candles. The way they burn, like they last twice as long as a regular candle. Uh, I'm a, I'm a uh, Xbox guy. I do have the PS4. And this one is called Fidelio. Fidelio, I had, the reason I'm naming it this is from one of my favorite movies, Eyes Wide Shut. So, oh man, saffron, very, very unique. Tobacco, hay, vanilla bean. These are, yeah, I know. Uh, wait, so I could get less stiff hair as if you use your low-hold products? Yes. Brandon, power cream is really, really strong. I have a lot of products. Yeah. So I'm working on that. How can you get thicker hair? Literally go on my channel and type and watch the video, how to get thicker hair. That's it. It's products. Uh, it's a long, drawn-out process. Basically, you have you work with a manufacturer, and there's lots of manufacturers out there. Um, yeah. And uh, you basically discuss with them what you're looking for. They'll send you a sample. You try it out. If you like it, then you move forward with it. You come up with the names, the packaging. All is a, It's a long process. I've done it so many times now that I have it pretty much down. Um, I'm working with a brand-new manufacturer. But it's a, it's a process. You have to test everything, you know. Yeah, I got that up. She even more. Yeah, wear a wig. Uh, my best soccer, favorite soccer player, I'm a Ronaldo guy, to be honest with you. I like Ronaldo, you know. I like Gareth Bale is my guy, too. I like Gareth Bale. He's sick, too. Um, let's see. Possible to make hair... Make thick hair thinner, yes, by thinning it out. Yep. Yeah, Ronaldo's good, man. Oh, that's sick. Second nature, man. Javi Garcia. Yes, 19 years old. Thank you, Briggs. I appreciate that. 19 years old. All right, we got one minute left. One minute left until the sale starts. All right, it's 11.59, one minute, no, I, I, I thought about it a long time ago. Sophia, holy crap, man. Sophia, yes, I have my own shears. Uh, screwed up someone's hair, no, please don't stop the live stream. Let's do this, it's midnight. It is now midnight. Sophia, what are you doing? And now, now, now that you're officially 18, Sophia, <clears throat> All right, guys, it is now midnight. Go to my website, thesalonguy.com slash shop, code black, 30, 30% off. 30% <laughs> off, the sale starts right now. Uh, I've never done a live stream like this. I appreciate all of you guys being there um, and, and hanging with me. All right, let's see here. I'm gonna go onto my shop right now. Let's see here. Yes. Let me just check everything to make sure everything is in order. Discounts. All right, it is active. The code is active. Black 30. It is now time. 30% off, people. Let's do it. Let's see those orders coming in, man. I know it takes, it takes minutes. Um, Sophia, thank you, Jose. I appreciate that. Frank, Frank is uh, right now, namaste, how you doing? Uh, Frank is, he's away right now, in Germany. Oh man, uh, Briggs, I appreciate that man, no problem, no problem. I'm gonna call you captain from now on, so you're, you're a captain, so I have to, have to respect my, the officers. Um, Sophia, are you still there? Oh, man. That's awesome. What's up, dude? 
Uh, how to curl hair without heat. I've done a video on that. You have to wrap the hair in a curl and clip it. I appreciate that, Leslie. Hello. So all of you that are just joining me, um, Black Friday is now in effect. 30% off all my products, code BLACK30, on my website, thesalonguy.com slash shop. I appreciate that. Brandon. Hey, what's going on, man? Namaste. I appreciate that. Um, saw your vid with Stuart. Talc looks sick. Yeah, talc is sick. It's my number one product. Number one product. Sophia, how was your birthday? What are you, like 22 now or something? <laughs> Good. Yes. I own the movie Devdas. Yup, here we go. First order came in. Thank you very much. Whoever bought it. First order came through. Um, a dance party. Cool. I look like Kristen Stewart. Thank you. Um, <laughs> were you, was I a good student? Yes, I was pretty good. I'm cute. Thank you. It's psych gum. What's going on, man? It's psych gum. How are you? You want a shout out? You got one. Uh, here's a sample of these candles, man. I'm changing the design, but dude, I'm telling you, these smell frigging phenomenal. Yup. They're in, manu in production right now. Yes, these are soy candles. So the way they burn, they're hand poured soy candles. They burn beautifully. They smell, everyone who smelled these are like, oh my God. You know, like the fragrances are nice. There's only two, well, there's, one of them has four cents. Um, and one of them has three cents in it. Yes, I make hair videos, that's right. So, um, hold on, Sophia. Hold on. Oh my God! Dude, my products are literally worst client you ever had to work with. Um, hmm. I don't know. It's been a long time. Good night, man. Good night. Orion, thank you. Your hair vids make me get the haircuts. That's awesome. I appreciate that. Hold on. I'm just, I'm just. Hold on a second. I'm sorry, guys. I'm looking at something. All right. I'm going to give, since you guys are with me on this, I want to show you something. Sophia, are you still there? I got to show you something. Thank you for saying that. All right. Check this out. So I'm coming out with a new dog shampoo, um, a sh do shampoo for dogs, and also a children. So... This is a photo of me that was transformed and sketched. That is me. So I'm coming out with a new shampoo called Suds. <laughs> That's funny, Briggs. Called Suds. It's a children's two-in-one shampoo and conditioner. The fragrance I chose was red apple and... <laughs> Sophia, red apple and jasmine. Oh my God. But that is me. That is a baby photo. And let me pull up the photo. Um, oh, that's awesome. That is awesome. Hold on. I'm trying to find the photo of myself. Let's see. Where the heck is my photo? Uh, Emma Watson. <laughs> that's great. I'm trying to find my baby picture, man. Where the heck's my baby picture? Ugh. Yes, two, another sale just came through. Thank you. But yeah, man, this is it. This is coming, and, and also, I'm going to show you. Here we go. Hold on a second. Um, let's see. Look at this. This is going to be my dog shampoo. 
I'm calling it Woof. Oh my god, another sale. Thank you so much. Woof. That is going to be, and I've been testing it out on people. It's cruelty free. Yeah, dude, this is going to make people. I'm already getting requests for this. Like, people, why is it that everybody. Like, everybody is willing to spend big money and buy, like, anything for their dogs. But I'm like, oh, I have shampoo for humans. Or, like, oh, that's all right. But I'm like, I have a sh coming out with shampoo for dogs. Or, like, I want it. What's up with people and their dogs, dude? Happy hey, Timothy, holy crap, man. Happy Thanksgiving. Are people that obsessed with their pets? Yeah, meow for, meow for kitties. That's sick. Burt's bees on your dog. That's awesome. Oh, thank you, Danny. I appreciate that, man. I'm going to ship them out tomorrow. I can't do anything to get you to 2,000 subscribers, to be honest with you. Uh, you know? All right. Yeah, man. Dude, this shampoo, I'm telling you, it's phenomenal. Oh, that's sick. I don't really have a wax, Sophia. Which one? I've got... All right, check this out. I have... This is my newest product right here called Slick. I just got it in. It's a very workable, pliable pomade. Um, look at this, man. It's a very warm, citrusy, like woodsy fragrance. These just, this just came in. It's a pomade that you can like work through your hair and it's not like oh, greasy or like super shiny. It's like the perfect, you know, uh, kind of combination. A very, very unique pomade. Very unique. And I'm doing 30% off. All right. 30% off is active all day. Ugh. All right. It's friggin'. Sophia, um, did you ever talk to Debbie and stuff? I appreciate that, Timothy. A picture of me with hair. The white one. Uh, let's see. The white one. Is it Bond paste? Hair mousse is great. I have one. Uh, let's see. Pronounce your name. Um, you have the greatest day if I pronounce your name. Approve Mishra. Approve Mishra. I, I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, but approve Mishra. Promote your video. Trying to hit, dude. Roast macaron uh, pomade for clay for fine. So pomade, I don't recommend pomades for fine hair. Okay, you can have fine hair um, and a lot of it, and a pomade is fine. But you have, if you have fine and thin hair, you don't want to use something that's going to make your hair look wet because it will make it look thinner. So I really like this new product, Slick. It's really, really insane, man. Slick is friggin' phenomenal. It's a very unique pomade. Very unique. Um, and... Air density. Yeah. No, it's not a matte finish, but, um, no, no, it's got some shine to it, but not, like, crazy shine, which is cool. Uh, oh, I pronounced it good. I hope I made your day. Thank you. Not, like, super shiny either. It's, like, right in the middle. Oh, thank you, Jose. I appreciate that. 25 is insane. Sophia, tell Jose how good 25 is. I'm not married. I'm single. Briggs, bro, you better, you better lock it down. You better you better spend at least a hundred bucks, dude. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> you gotta represent Jersey. That's weird. Um, Timothy, I don't know yet. Uh, which clay is the best under ten dollars? I don't know. Thank you, bro. Buy twenty five of them. <laughs> Can you use hair? What, what does that mean, dude? This this eighty four minutes. This live stream has been going 84 minutes, and there's people that have been on here for like the whole 84 minutes. I really appreciate that. Let me just plug in my phone because it's like dying. Do a vlog outside of the studio. Yeah, I know. I'm working on that. I'm moving into a brand new apartment, which is sick. Nah, I can't do an all nighter, man. I can't do an all nighter. I have to sleep. Uh, a picture of me with hair. Why have you been watching me the last 40 minutes? 
Why have I been streaming the last 40 minutes, Matt? I don't know. <laughs> All right. Um, under 10, maybe it's, I have no idea. Yes, Briggs. I'm in New Brunswick. Captain, I'm in New Brunswick. But I only see private appointments. Uh, let's see. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, Briggs, I don't do like razor shape ups. I kind of do, but not like barber style, but like, you know. Uh, I'm trying to. Let me find a picture of me with hair. Hold on a second. Hold on. How many of you, are you guys following me on Instagram? It's the salon guy. At the salon guy on Instagram. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Let me see my photos right now. Let us see. All right. Who wants to like, who wants to look at my Facebook photos and see what I have? Let's just do like a Facebook photo. Yes, follow makeup artistry Sophia. She's amazing. Yeah, lineups, it's all the same. Everything is the salon guy. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. Thank you, man. Represent, you know what I mean? All right. Thank you. Awesome, Jose. I appreciate that. All right, let's look at my Facebook photos. Let's just like, let's Facebook and look, the first thing we come up, this is me as a child. I think this is me at like, oh man, maybe I was like five here or something like that or six. I have no idea, but that's me with my blonde hair last week. All right, let's see. What else? What do I got? This is me and my son. Long, this is a couple years ago. That's my son and I. That's a client of mine. She's an author of a book. That's some beautiful blonde promoting my hair products. That's a hairstylist. Some of my products. A client of mine. Fantastic, that's me doing Trump's hair. Fantastic, I have to tell you. Okay, I have to tell you. There you go. Absolutely fantastic. Okay, I have phenomenal hair. Even Melania says I have phenomenal hair, okay? Fantastic. <laughs> I, <laughs> uh, there's a picture of me at an event, a model of mine, another gorgeous blonde, um, friend of mine, friend of mine, Zelda. Look at this. Does everybody remember that? Dylan Sprouse, okay? The Cole brothers, the Sprouse brothers. I don't know if you guys know this, so this went viral. Cole Sprouse and Dylan Sprouse literally promoted my um, video and they, uh, they tweeted it. Is that crazy? <laughs> that's nuts. That's me, that's like creeper hair right there. This is, okay, rant, these are people here. Um. Look at this, guys. So, you know Macklemore, the artist Macklemore? Well, he re remixed one of my videos a long time ago. This is crazy. He remixed one of my hair videos. <laughs> Man, that's nuts. Wow, this is a long time ago. Look at that. Anyone know who that is? Yeah, Shadow Grit is sick. Grit Pomade. Bye, Sophia. Happy Thanksgiving. Alec Baldwin. Bye. Thank you. That's me at the Oscars. The Oscars. Thank you. Meet the Oscars. Yeah, man. Me and Lance Bass. You guys know Lance Bass? <laughs> Schnazzy. Yeah. Dude, I've done a lot of stuff. I've been on the radio. I've been on television. Um, yeah, I've got me at home, oh, man. My sister. 
I've done a lot of stuff, man. Sometimes I reflect and I go back at this stuff and I'm just like, look at this picture, dude. Look at this. Look at that fucking beard. Look at that thing. This was at Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week. No, yes, this was a Fashion Week a couple years ago. Look at that thing. That's Josh Mario John. I actually cut his hair in a video um, a while back. Yeah, Josh Mario John is sick. He's from Canada. He's an awesome dude, man. Yeah, <laughs> look at that thing. <laughs> oh, all right. This is um, this is Rudy Youngblood, and he was in the movie Apocalypto. Um, and uh, this is he he played Jaguar Paw in the movie Apocalypto, and I cut his hair. Thank you. Almighty A, I appreciate that. So I cut his hair. Yeah, man. These are all just like photos and stuff of me. <laughs> that was my doppelganger. Kirk. <laughs> Family. Yes, I've met Mariano, yep. Lily Galici. Yeah, I met Mariano. <laughs> no, but they say I look like him. I am talking. No, Matt, I never did. I'm 43. 43. Yeah, Vin Diesel. <laughs> man, these are some old ass photos, man. Damn. This is me on Good Morning America. I did a segment on Good Morning America, which was fun. Look at all these photos, man. Man, this brings back memories. I've done a lot of stuff. Yup. Yup, yup, yup. <laughs> That was in California. All right. Well, listen, guys. Uh, I appreciate this. I'm going to sign off because it's getting late. This live stream has been going for 92 mi 93 minutes. So thank you, Carbon. Um, I'm not really doing haircut tutorials right now. But anyway, don't forget to check out my Black Friday sale. Uh, I'm, I'm ending it now, man. I'm tired. But uh, code BLACK30, go to my website, buy some stuff. But happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Thank you for the support. Thank you for this amazing live stream. And um, you guys are all awesome. Yes, you'll love 25, man. It's sick. Captain, thank you. And um, I'll see you all very, very soon. Bye.